Hey there folks, Bill O'Leary coming to you uh, this Thursday afternoon, coming to you live as part of the series we call our Thirsty Thursday series, where every Thursday at about the same time uh, I go live to talk about a, a topic that uh, uh, is of interest to folks, uh, of interest uh, as it relates to sort of what I do for a living. So uh, I'm an estate planning and elder law and probate attorney uh, with Legacy Planning Law Group. So. Um, if you're thirsting for knowledge, you've come to the right place. So today's topic uh, is uh, what I like to call uh, transferring your IRA, individual retirement account, transferring the RMD to charity. Why is this a good idea? So when you have a retirement account, there comes a time when you're going to have to start taking the money out. You can't leave it in there forever. Uh, if you have an IRA, you have to start taking out a, a minimum amount each year um, when does that start? Well, it's, it's in the year when you turn age 72. This minimum amount is called a required minimum distribution. We call it RMD for short. Uh, so if you have, uh, let's say, instead of an IRA, you have an employer plan like a 401k, you can actually delay your RMD past age 72 if you're still working and if the 401k plan lets you, to, uh, lets you delay. Now, back to the IRA. What if you don't really need the RMD and you instead want to give the money uh, to a charity? Can you do that? Well, the answer is yes. Uh, and you do it by um, uh, what's called a Qualified Charitable Distribution, also known as a QCD. QCDs have been around for about 10 years in our tax law, and as they, as they continue to gain popularity, a lot of questions get asked about the rules uh, that apply, and they, frankly, they can be confusing. So. I want to go ahead and give you seven, seven um, facts, QCD facts, that will keep you on the straight and narrow with your QCD transactions. Number one, a QCD is capped at $100,000 per person per year. And for a married couple where, where each spouse is their own IRA, each spouse can contribute up to that $100,000 amount from uh, their IRA for a total of $200,000. Number two, rule number two, you cannot take a QCD from a 401k, only an IRA account. Three, a QCD, Qualified Charitable Distribution, must be done as, as a, a direct transfer to the charity. You cannot take the RMD out of your IRA account, deposit the money into your bank account, and then cut a check to the charity. It doesn't work. You, um, uh, the, the rules are broken. Now, um, um, so again, the rules are broken, the sort of the special tax benefits that you get with the QCD are lost. Number four, you cannot benefit in any way from the distribution that's made to the, to the charity. No coffee mugs, no tote bags, doesn't work. Five, the charitable donation that's made from the IRA, it can satisfy your RMD requirements. So whatever your RMD is, that will be considered satisfied, that requirement, by instead transferring the money to uh, a charity. Now, interestingly, the IRA distribution is not includable in your income as it ordinarily would. If it's going to the charity, it's not includable in your income, okay? Um, number six, number six, you cannot take a charitable tax deduction. Even though you're giving money to a charity, you can't take a charitable a tax deduction because actually this would be double dipping because the amount that you've pulled out of the IRA it's not included in your income to begin with so to, to, to have it not included in your income but also to get a charitable tax deduction again that'd be a double dip that's not allowed and uh, number seven uh, uh, sort of issue number seven or question number seven that we see out there if more than a hundred thousand dollars is withdrawn from the IRA and it's contributed to the charity, there is no carryover to a future year. You can't carry that over to a future year. The excess is going to be taxable income. Now, having said that, uh, you are then in that situation entitled to that charitable tax deduction uh, for the overage as long as you itemize your deductions. So, if you'd like to know a little bit more about transferring your IRA RMD uh, to charity and whether it's a good idea. And, and if you'd like to know more and maybe how we can help, we'd love to talk to you. So we invite you to schedule a free 15-minute discovery phone call. Discovering is easy. Just go to our website, LegacyPlanningLawGroup.com, and click on the Book Your Free Call uh, button. It's going to give you a chance, frankly, 
uh, to tell us what your concerns are and uh, what your situation is, and that way we can tell you uh, if we can help you. By the way, that 15-minute call is complimentary. If you've enjoyed uh, this video, we'd ask that you like it, and better yet, share it with uh, as many friends as you can. Um, so I plan on giving another Facebook Live talk uh, next Thursday at about the same time, like I said, same day. Uh, and time, just a different topic. So if you're thirsting for knowledge, we will quench your thirst. So Bill O'Leary on this Thursday is signing off for now, and on behalf of everybody here at my firm, Team Legacy, go make it a great day and a better world.